Hello, Mario. AutoCAD 2D Level 1, Session 8, Printing and Plotting. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Right, in this uh, instructional video, we're going to be producing our wares, printing and plotting. So after we've drawn all our plans and done all our calculations and got everything down on paper, now we're going to try and print it out to put it in front of our clients so they can see our brilliance. So let's get over to the Moodle site and see what's happening there. So it's a um, session. So don't forget the vlogs from the previous sessions, which keep you up to date as to what went on there. And then um, over to, in this case, um, we're going to be looking at session eight. Okay, printing and plotting. So here's our video that we're producing at the moment as we speak and which I will do live in class, sort of. And here's the notes associated with session eight. Okay, and so they should be um, coming up anytime soon. Um, I would have hoped, but uh, well, here they go here. So I might have just had a little bit of a glitch there and slideshow and from the beginning. So here's our cover sheet, session eight, printing and plotting. And that's my contact details. Always available if you want to contact me. Um, we're going to it's, follow the same pattern that we've followed in the previous seven sessions. So we come in, it's very important that we sign the register so that we know that we're here. And then I give this brief introduction, uh, an opportunity to ask any questions, and then we'll be working away in session eight on chapters 15 and 16 from the course booklet. Then just before it's time to go home, we have a bit of a recap and look forward. Although generally I've found that everybody seems to be res relatively happy with the what they're doing in terms of um, moving the moving stuff uh, forward. Um, so we should start to get some finish now and some people moving on to other projects and things like that. But uh, so far so good. So uh, let's just have a look at um, what's going to happen in session eight. So the chapter 15 looks at um, layouts. So you should have previewed and plotted layouts, printed and plotted layouts or parts thereof in a DWF and PDF formats. Now these are all file formats where you're printing to a file. DWF is sort of a, a CAD format. Whereas PDF is a generalized text picture format that you should all be familiar with. The idea of each one of those is that they're a portable document format. In other words, uh, a number of programs can write to those formats and anyone can see what's happening. Now, um, you should have in Chapter 16 um, be creating viewports and adjusting viewport views by zooming and uh, all sorts of other little things is happening in chapter 16. So that's what we've got programmed for today's session. And well, time now for any questions and answers. I'm not aware of any uh, questions that uh, have come up um, at this point in time. Obviously, I have to prepare ahead. Um, we have had a uh, a little, well, one a sort of question that's come in that we're working on. But uh, generally, uh, things have been pretty quiet in that regard. But we'll see what comes up in class. And if something does come up, well, we can record it here in the vlog afterwards or separately in um, a number of other things. So, yep, a question and answers. Nothing's really come up. I guess the book and the resources seem to answer most of the questions. So well, what's new in Moodle? So let's um, go over and have a, a look at the uh, Moodle site that we have, um, which is just sitting 
down here and we're in session eight so here's our video here's our session notes session 15 or chapter 15 has one video on printing layouts and check plots check plots are very important you should uh, keep copies of check plots and work that you've done to check your work as part of the QA process very important that you keep that stuff chapter 16 uh, looks at um, printing as associated with mechanical projects in the first instance and in the second instance um, printing associated with architectural projects so not a lot of um, not a great number of uh, tasks and videos there but some pertinent uh, tasks are nonetheless so when you've finished uh, obviously those um, tasks one should review um, both chapters just go back over what you've done just to refresh your mind pick up any little bits and pieces that uh, may come to light as you're working through the things and then go on to preview chapters 17 and 18 for the next session session 9 now I've got session 9 and 10 set up there the formatted there but the actual videos themselves haven't been made yet so they're ready to go um, and to some extent but um, they're sort of under construction so we're we're getting everything ready towards the end of the uh, to the end of the course um, at which point then we will have the full thing there and you will have access um, to to it at um, you know for some time yet so um, I think that's a pretty good introduction to session eight there being no not too many questions and we seem to be making good progress so I think I'll leave it there cheers see you